Hello and welcome, I'm Vasquez and this is City Skylines. In this episode guys, I want to show you the biggest expansion that I created on this city. So the expansion is pretty pretty big and I want to show you every single detail that I made. Obviously I showed you something that I built in the time lapse, but let's cover the entire city like this. This is the biggest expansion that I did on this series and look at it it's three or four times the size of the first city this is the border of the second part this is the biggest expansion and this is the original city that we started and let's start with the beginning of course this is the entrance and uh, it has a system so you can go in and out of the city with no problems and uh, obviously I built the city to be big and uh, I wanted to create more people, more buildings, uh, not like in the pr first one where there was a lot of houses, but I stayed here with the tune. As you can see here, uh, there is a subtle, subtle change from housing to a little bit bigger buildings like this or this and to a little bit higher buildings like the city is growing the buildings are being destroyed and uh, much much bigger buildings are being built so this is the effect and the city looks more natural like this so I think it's okay and I like it another thing you maybe notice there is a lot of trees oh yeah I like trees and uh, I think the city looks much much better if you have more trees and parks so this is the part of a city here that's really new uh, the city is not very grown yet but I decided to record this episode because I done so much work and I want to share you with you so you can see what I did here and uh, there's a lot of on and off ramps here as you can see there is no uh, car problems in the city minimum because I have so much traffic um, I have metro I have trams I have uh, trains everything is set up to be really really good I like this area a lot I think it's beautiful the river and this is the monorail tra uh, tracks and here is the station of monorail yeah it's just looking really really good and uh, I decided to make something like this I wanted to make a pretty big roundabout here and I want to make something in the middle that will be different that will be a little bit odd I mean there's a lot of rocks there's some caves here oh it's pretty deep uh, and there is a cave around here but I wanted to hide it a little bit just to be a little bit more uh, interesting and uh, yeah so this is the biggest expansion and this is the original city that we started to play uh, all metro and uh, monorail stations are connected the city is connected on all sides and uh, yeah you can see here there's a lot of huge buildings and there's housing I mean I think this is real because you don't have a city where it's just high-rising buildings uh, and uh, towers like this you will always have a smaller housing or some small buildings like this and I think it's re realistic um, and uh, yeah let's show you like this yeah it's looking good it's looking really really good and um, let's go and see the numbers currently there is 80,000 people living here and in the biggest expansion uh, 59,000 people are living so very very much people are here uh, let's go with the traffic as you can see the traffic is pretty pretty good there is no huge problems with crowding and people are moving people are not having any problems to go on one end of the city to the other and uh, yeah 
there is a lot of schemes here uh, these are road system and metro system as well uh, let's go and see the transport uh, 3000 people are moving into transport so that is very very good we have a mix of buses metro train uh, monorail and cable cars that are doing the job really really good especially in this area i think on the in the beginning this was a little bit higher around 500 so uh, yeah uh, let's go to the system here again and uh, yeah transportation is really really big here and I think uh, I will need to expand it even more because I see some problems around here uh, yeah this is a problem that I need to fix um, because I have so much of that um, another thing uh, the this expansion is not finished uh, I want to upgrade the transport system a little bit more I want to create a little bit more monorails on this part because I don't have any uh, here I have it's connected but here I don't so I want to connect uh, this part of the city with monorail with some bus lines and maybe one more metro station but I see a problem uh, with Metro currently, so maybe I will cancel a little bit of Metro uh, to make it a little bit efficient. So I think this is looking okay. This is on the lower point and uh, people can cross, cross it, of course. I made some pedestrian bridges. Of course, uh, people are moving in and uh, there is one more here. A lot of people are moving in and this is the monorail you can see the carts are going in people are moving so yeah and this is the main train station um, the train station is not moving a lot of people currently but eventually when I expand the city even more uh, I will have more train stations and I hope that it will move a lot of people after uh, and I wanted to do with train station so I build these barriers over here because I didn't want somebody go in. Uh, I know in the game it's not possible but maybe it's a little bit realistic that nobody can go in near the rails and we have the pedestrian walks over here and it's guarded by this wall and uh, that is realistic I think. And yeah I think uh, I don't want to mess you a lot with this episode uh, because I think the city is okay uh, the city is growing exponentially I created something beautiful and I want to continue to work on this city uh, I have some plans to make a lot of areas and I have a plan to make a farm a big big farming system uh, I will show you uh, you can see here there is a lot of resources that I'm not using uh, and I need to change that so I think I will move some of my industrial because you can see I have a high demand for industrial or offices so uh, I have a lot of offices in the city I will show you I have so much you can see the blue you can see the blue there is so many offices and still it, it's not enough and I want to move my city uh, sorry my industry here I will create farms on this part and this part and this part the this big part will be only farms only industry and uh, I think I will go and connect here um, this here obviously is rich with ore but I will need to do some uh, changes with land maybe I will do on a small part and uh, try to create another industry but all of this needs to be connected very very good with the city because people will need to come here to work and uh, the and the trains metro everything needs to be connected people will come uh, goods will need to move so yeah uh, for this part where is the rich with oil I'm not really sure what will I do because it's really really close to the city and I think it will be looking really really ugly if I have some industry over here that is very dirty so I will think about that I will think about that so let's me let's go to the map as you can see I have only five tiles open uh, 
there's a lot of room to be expanding and uh, next episode will be for farms and uh, finishing this small area here that I wanted to uh, change I made it something like rocks and here with trees but I want to change it I want to make some living area and uh, yeah as you can see there's a lot of room to be expanding and uh, let's show you the map I think this island is pretty pretty interesting I will eventually come to this and this is going to be really really good so let me know in the comments what you guys think uh, do you like the city do you like the road system the transport system uh, do I need to change something if you don't like something write it on a comment press that like button press this like if you don't like it of course um, and uh, yeah please comment if you like or don't like something and uh, see you in the next video bye everybody and thank you for watching